Welcome everyone. This is Chloe with Cousin DIY. Another trend in 2022 is the return of body chains. As you saw on our model, who is wearing an off the shoulder, simple body chain. That is what I will be showing you how to make today. I've laid it out for you so you can see how simple the construction is. This is the choker that goes around the neck. That measures 15 inches. I sized it to our model. This is the drape that drapes under the arm. That measured 18 inches. This is the connector that connects the choker to the arm, three and a half inches. And then we have the four draping chains. This one is five and three quarters. This one is 10. This one is 14 and a half. And the bottom one is 19. Depending on body size, uh, length of arms, neck, torso, you can always adjust these measurements, larger or smaller. So I'm gonna get set up and I'll show you how to make it. So the first step is to make our choker. I'm using four millimeter jump rings which are quite small because I want this to look very delicate. First, I'm going to use a jump ring to attach the extender chain, which I cut to three inches. Uh, now you don't absolutely need an extender chain, but it will make it a little more adjustable. You want to make sure that all your jump rings are closed nice and snug. The next step will be to attach a lobster clasp to the other end of the chain. We'll be using lots of jump rings in this project. Next, I'm just going to straighten the chain out because I want it to be nice. I don't want it to be twisted when I'm constructing this. So I'm just going to make sure it's nice and flat. And I'm going to connect it to the jump ring on this side. Lay that out. Next, we will connect the ends of the arm chain together. And I'm going to take another jump ring and connect one end of the three and a half inch chain, which is the shoulder connecting chain to that jump ring. When you make this at home, you're going to want to determine where the middle of the shoulder is and where you want to connect that to the choker. And I know that 
Mine measured uh, three and a half inches from the clasp. So I'm just gonna, when I measured my model's neck, so I'm just going to measure approximately three and a half inches. Connect the other end of that chain to my choker at that point. is right about right about there double check oh, a little went a little too far three and a half is about right there Check that length again. That's a little short this time. Right there. And the last step is going to be to add our drapes. So we'll start with a five and three quarter inch. And I, through experimentation, determined that I wanted to start my first, let me slide this down a little bit. I wanted to start my first drape about four link, links down from the, uh, from the connecting chain. So we'll count down four. One, two, three. Connect that there. Now you want to do your best to make sure that your chain isn't twisting when you connect it on each side so that these chains will lay nice and flat against the body. Two, three, four. So we're going to do the same thing on the other side. Next, we're going to measure down five links from where we attached the previous chain. And I'm going to slide this down a little closer. I'm going to count down five. One, two, three, four. Double check, I've got that right. One, two, three, four, five. And we'll do the same with the other end, making sure the chain is lying nice and flat. I'll repeat that two more times. First with the 14 and a half inch chain. Count down five links on each side. Then I'll do the same with the 19 inch. And then our body chain will be complete.
There you have it. As you can see, it was pretty, pretty easy to make, pretty basic. If you make your own body chain, we'd love to see it. Please share it with us on Instagram at hashtag createwithcousin. Thanks for joining us today. See you next time. Bye.